It's your girl Crystal, aka Curly Chris. Welcome back for another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about Amazon must haves for natural hair. About all of us got Prime, especially since we are in a pandemic, a Panasonic, okay? We all got Amazon Prime, so we can most definitely use that one day shipping to get everything that we need for one to two day shipping, to get everything that we need for our natural hair. And let's be real, Amazon most of the time has cheaper prices as well, so we can almost definitely take advantage of that. So that's why I want to make today's video so you guys can know what are my faves for natural hair, especially if you are newly natural or if you already been natural, I get so many questions on things that I use on a day-to-day -day basis. So I said, let me go ahead and make this Amazon video something that we all have access to and can get these useful products soon, quick, and without leaving the comfort of our own home. So it's up, it's lit, it's up. It's up. <laughs> It's tough. Let me stop. Anyway, so before going to get into the video, if you are new to your girl's channel, make sure you do one thing for your girl, okay? And that's to smash that button down below. Smash that button down below. Hey, like you mean it, and join the Curly Chris fam. We would love to have you here. So let's go ahead and jump right into all of the Amazon must-haves for natural hair. Everything that I mentioned in today's video will be linked below so you guys can go ahead and grab whatever it is that interests you. Okay, so first thing first, y'all, something that, like, honestly, I feel like it's one of my mostly asked about items are these large satin scrunchies that I am always using on my hair to pull back my hair, especially whenever I sleep, I use these large scrunchies, and I get so many questions on them because of how big they are. And what I typically do for my nighttime routine is pull my hair back to about right here, and it also pushes the hair out of my face so I can wash my face, and then I put my bonnet on top of that, and it kind of prevents my hair from being really, really smushed whenever I wake up. So these are bomb and they are stretchy and they are satin. And the best way to get these on your head is from the back. So on the back on up and then put it where you want it to be around your head. And it fits the large, like the largest circumference of your head without it being tight. So that's really why I love these satin scrunchies. And so many of y'all have purchased them already. So I most definitely had to include that in today's video. These large satin scrunchies that are bomb, even for banding as well. The banding method, if you prefer to do it with satin versus the scrunchies that I use, then perfect for that and they are so huge. And they are only seven bucks on Amazon, so you most definitely need that. So the next thing that I'm gonna talk about will be scrunchies. So the ones that I highly recommend every natural has is a pack of large scrunchies. And these are just the regular scrunchies, not satin, but they are the elastics. And they are the ones that do not have any metal hooks on them whatsoever, but they are large. So this is the regular size scrunchie and this is the one that I'm talking about getting. And I tell you guys, I use these all the time. Whether I'm pulling my hair back into a puff or I'm banding, I mainly use these for banding because they are so long. So I'm able to use like maybe two of them for a whole band versus like having to use about seven of these. So it really, really is helpful. And it also is helpful for anyone who has a huge puff and wear a lot of puffs. You can literally just take one of these and tie your puff instead of doing multiple. So I really do recommend these. You most definitely need this in your natural hair stash and from Amazon, you can have it the very next day. So highly, highly recommend. And they don't tear your hair out because they don't have that metal part on them. Instead, it's just all the way around elastic. And a whole pack of these are only $4 on Amazon and you get a good amount in one pack. Now that we're on the scrunchie kick, let's keep it there. And the next one that I wanna talk about are just these regular scrunchies. Um, they're regular size, they're not as big um, as the extra long ones. But what I like to use these for y'all, as of lately, is whenever I just wanna put my hair in a puff, but I don't want to use an elastic 
or like something that's really, really tight. I just want it to still be able to hold all of my hair together without having to wrap it two times or three times. These are perfect. And these are just also large satin um, scrunchies and they have elastic in the inside. And I also was able to find some of these on Amazon because um, I got this one from Target and my best friend got me this one from Urban Outfitters. But I found some that's similar on Amazon so I most definitely have that down below. So next thing I wanna get into is in the showers. Pretty much we all wash our hair in the shower, especially if you low porosity and you watch my videos, I'm pretty sure you wash that hair in the shower, sis, okay? So one thing that you most definitely are going to need is a shower mirror. So one that has a suction cup and sticks on the wall of your shower so that way you can like see whatever you're doing and also it does not fog. I have one linked in my Amazon store for you to pick up. This is one thing that you most definitely will need so you can see what you are doing in your hair. And it does not fog, so that is perfect. And if it does fog, there's ways that you can like make it stop fogging. I think one of the ways is like shaving cream or toothpaste and wipe it off and it'll help with the fogging. But I have one in my Amazon store for 20 bucks and it's bomb. The next thing I wanna talk about for the shower is the shower caddy. And that's the one that I use, you guys have probably seen in my videos, where I have all of my products on that caddy. And these are honestly ones you can get from Target or Walmart, but in case you don't want to step outside, you can get it from Amazon and have it tomorrow. <laughs> so these are the shower caddies, and they are about $24 on Amazon and one that I have I have linked down below and once again It's bomb for the shower to have all of your products stashed there Including like your um, brushes your combs your shampoo your conditioner your leave-in conditioner <laughs> And even if you are styling your hair in the shower as well It's perfect to have everything in that one caddy instead of scattered everywhere in your shower now since we're talking about the shower you most definitely are going to be detangling so let me put you on game on what brush you need for the detangling process and y'all should already know enough to say these brushes are dirty mind your business not of mine <laughs> um these are the felicia leatherwood brushes these are super dirty right now because i that's how much i use these things um, and I have two of them and I love the Felicia Leatherwood brushes and these are also on Amazon now so you can get them on Amazon and have them delivered to your doorstep and if you watch my videos I get so many questions on sis what brush is that what brush is that is that the easy detangler no it's the Felicia Leatherwood black on brush okay make sure you get one and a lot of them are actually like there's also dupes out there or replicas of them and I feel like none of them really compare to the original so just go ahead and buy the original it's about 18 bucks online um, and it's also linked down below and it's the brush that I live by for my detangling it does not tear my hair out whatsoever and it's very very good at getting those kinks out now the next thing I want to talk about I don't really get asked about this because I feel like this is actually a pretty well-known item but I want to mention it because there's a really big difference in this type of item and those are hair clips so hair clips are something that we all have right however I feel like there's a lot of hair clips that tear the hair out and we just don't talk about that and the ones that I feel really tear the hair out are the duck clips the ones where you um, pinch the end and it opens like this and it has like those teeth in it. I feel like those, whenever I use them from any brand, they really tear my hair out. Or not tear, but like jerk my hair whenever I go to take the clip out. But with these, I have never experienced that. Like I use these clips and they also don't break. <laughs> I'm so tired of the other ones breaking on the sis. I've gone through so many packs of them, but these y'all, they do not break whatsoever. They're super durable and they're also much cheaper. I found on Amazon a pack of 12 of them for five bucks and they're super bound for thick hair, all that, like, and they do not break. I hate whenever I'm using a clip, I go to clip my hair and it pops. Like, what's the point? Someone explain it to me, okay? <laughs> So whenever you're deep conditioning, of course you wanna use a shower cap. So there's a few different items that I wanted to include in my Amazon store for the deep conditioning slash shower cap <laughs> um, aura. And one of them is just plain old shower caps. 
Now for me, I use a plastic bag for my groceries. I just put that plastic bag on my head and tie it. But in case you are someone who don't have those and you just like disposable shower caps, I did include some regular disposable shower caps on my Amazon store as well. And these are bomb for deep conditioning whenever you get underneath the hooded dryer or whenever you put that leave-in conditioner on in the shower and you haven't quite styled your hair yet, go ahead and pop one of them bad boys on and keep all that moisture in until you're ready to style. Now, the step above that will be the aluminum shower cap. So the aluminum one is when you can't really deep condition or you don't have the means to deep condition. So you need to do something that's quick but still effective and more useful and works better than a regular clear shower cap, a plastic one, and that would be the aluminum shower cap. And I also have that link, and I'll leave a picture of it right here, the one I'm talking about. Now, the reason why this one works so well for deep conditioning is because the aluminum traps the heat in from your scalp and from the product and makes the product seep into your strands even more. So that's why the aluminum one is like more recommended than just a regular plastic shower cap if you're trying to deep condition. Um, and it's also good if, once again, if you step out the shower and you haven't styled yet, it basically just forces the moisture into your hair. Um, so that's the aluminum shower cap. Now, what I ultimately recommend is regular deep conditioning with heat. Now, I have a hooded dryer that I use for mine, but in case you don't have a hooded dryer, you can just use the thermal heat cap. The thermal heat cap, let me grab the one I have so I can show you guys. So this is my thermal heat cap from The Joyful Bee, which is a black owned business, but I found them on Amazon as well. It's not the same company or anything. Like Joyful Bee and also Thermal Heat Cap, which is like the main company who started out, well, I'm not sure they started it, but it's the company that everyone really knows of whenever they hear of Thermal Heat Cap. You get it from Thermal Heat Cap. Um, and they, and what they basically do is you pop them in the microwave and there's flax seeds in the inside that activate and they keep your hair warm and they produce warmth to work as a deep conditioning process. So I did find some on Amazon um, that are pretty reasonably priced as well. So check that out if you do not already have any type of means of deep conditioning. You most definitely should have a microwave. <laughs> so you most definitely should have a microwave. So this is perfect for you to still get that deep conditioning in without having to get a whole hooded dryer. So one side note thing that I wanted to mention has nothing to do with hair at all, but if you have never gotten exfoliating gloves, hello? If you have never gotten exfoliating gloves for your body or even for those parts, you most definitely should get some of these. I recently did that and they are bomb, okay? Okay. Now on to the styling process. So the number one thing that I use whenever I style my hair is a brush for defining, for definition. Not for detangling, these are defining brushes. And those will be the Denman style brushes. So this one is an actual Denman brush. This is the mini travel size. And this is the Pattern Beauty brush, which is very, very similar to a Denman. Now the reason why I love these brushes is because they really do a great job with giving me that bomb definition without tearing any of my hair out. Do not detangle with these brushes in the shower. These are strictly styling <laughs> brushes. And the reason why I also like Denman is because the larger versions of them, you can take out the bristles. I'm not sure if you can do it in the smaller one. In case there's too many rows, you can take a row of the bristles out. So that's also really cool. And I've linked the different size ones in the store as well. So the next thing I wanna talk about are perm rods. Um, I recently just now ordered some new perm rods off of Amazon, some purple ones, I mean some orange ones, because next week we will be getting into the Perm Rod 101 series. So excited for that, love that for me, love that for y'all. Um, I know so many of y'all are going to really enjoy this 101 series for Perm Rods, so that is coming up, and I want you guys to do it with me. So if you have not picked up your Perm Rods, or if you don't have any, Get them from Amazon today so they will be in by the time we start the series and we can do our perm rods together. I linked below a really cheap um, pack. It's an 80 pack for $15 and it comes with 40 of this size and 40 of, the, of a different size. So most definitely I do recommend getting those perm rods. Now the next thing that I wanna talk about are satin lined beanies. 
Y'all, I'm trying to give y'all game. Y'all know how much I love my satin line beanies. Um, I have the regular ones and I have the thicker ones. These are all from Grace Alaye and she's also on Amazon now, but I've also found other shops that have much cheaper ones. And I mean, the quality still doesn't look like it's pretty good, but they also have different styles. So I love the satin line beanies because they're great for the winter and they're also great for on the go. And even in the summer, they have looser, not as thick materials. I love my satin line beanies. I get so many questions whenever I wear these. So I'm giving y'all the game right now. And I'm also giving you guys a cheaper option. So make sure to go check that out if you are interested. Now the next thing that we're talking about is something that we should all need, okay? If you don't have this item, I'm not sure how you are natural. And those are bonnets. You have to have the bonnet, sis or bro, whenever you are sleeping, okay? The satin line bonnets at that. This one is from Isokin Inofe. It's an African designer who does satin line bonnets and I love, love, love the bonnets. I did find a cheaper option on Amazon and they look, still look bomb, honestly. So check that out if you are more into like the cute printed type of bonnets. Um, and now this one is one I get asked about so freaking much. This is a main choice bonnet, but they don't sell them anymore, I don't think. So I did find an alternative one that um, is satin on the outside and on the inside for you guys on Amazon. So check that out as well. And you have to have a bonnet if you are natural. The next thing that you must have if you are natural is a satin scarf, honey. What are you doing if you don't have a satin scarf? You gotta tie them edges down. If you have the twist in your hair, you gotta tie those down. You have to tie the bun down to get that surface slick and wavy, okay? You have to have a satin scarf somewhere in your routine, sis, or bro. So y'all already know I got y'all on that. So I also linked some of those in the Amazon store. Um, and they also have different patterns in case you do like a variety of patterns, you feel me? This one I got from my local beauty supply store, I believe, but it was like 10 years ago y'all like it was a long time ago um so most definitely get you a satin scarf now the next thing i want to talk about is a continuous mister i really do like these myself like i feel like the continuous spray bottles are like really really cool because you can get a continuous spray um and i don't really use a spray bottle in my styling process too much because my, my hair retains the moisture from the leave-in conditioner in the shower. However, whenever I'm doing like a slick back bun or something like that, I most definitely reach for my spray bottle. So I did link this below as well because I feel like everyone would need a spray bottle and it most definitely is a must have. So another thing I want to mention, this item, y'all, when I first saw it, I was like, this ain't for black people. But y'all, it is. It works really, really good on our hair. And those are these um, coily, scrunchy, cape, whatever you wanna call them, the little coily things like this. They do not rip our hair out whatsoever. Y'all, I've done so many buns with these and it works so well on my hair. Like, I was shocked, I was shook. So I actually linked these down below for you guys as well in case you do like to do a lot of up high puffs or even back puffs they don't have the good like hold but if you in case you just want to like throw your hair up and don't want like a um scrunchy these are great for no tension and still holds everything in place now the last thing that i want to talk about is just some regular regular picks um one thing that I like to mention about my picks is I don't like a pick that has the metal. I like all plastic picks. They don't tear your hair out as much and it's really just better for the hair in my opinion. So these are also linked. Um, it's just a regular pick, but I feel like they are much more useful than the other ones. And you need this for your volume to get that hair, this, this type of shape and size that you want. So most definitely gotta have the picks on deck. Oh, and lastly, product-wise, this is my last product. This is my only product that I'm recommending to you guys, and that's the Originals Honey and Castor Edge Gel. Y'all, don't say I ain't put you on game. Don't say I ain't put you on game, okay? Okay. So, fam, that was everything that I wanted to recommend to y'all from Amazon. An Amazon must-have list. Let me know if there's anything on my list that you are most definitely going to snatch up and get. And also let me know if you guys enjoyed this type of video. 
Let me know in the comments down below and also give me a thumbs up. If you are new here, go ahead and subscribe to your girl's channel, okay? We would love to have you. We really, really would. So thank y'all so much for tuning in. I really do hope my entire video got y'all together with these Amazon must-haves because listen, I can't go without them, okay? So thank y'all so much for tuning in and I'm gonna see you guys in my next video. Yo!